Alright, welcome back to Inglet. Kind of weird that the intro plays like every time. I mean, I guess that's fairly common, but we've seen it once. So there we go. Uh, yeah, I mean, what else to say? Let's just jump back in, I guess. I don't really remember where we were. Oh, God, I'm 73% done. I see. <laughs> okay, I didn't think the game was quite that short. So I guess we're finishing it today, but I guess I'll uh, I'll want to try some like other game modes and stuff. Are there like achievements? There are, uh, but I, I guess I'm like six out of 11. Maybe that's just maybe that's it. You know, you do those achievements and those are the levels and then we're done. So, yeah, I might try some different difficulties and stuff. I think there was also that bonus world, which I guess doesn't have any achievements or maybe that is an achievement. I don't know. So, uh, where are we going? Down there. I don't know if I should, like, do something else to warm up again, but I think I remember everything. Five of those things to find. That's kind of a weird thing. You think there's an achievement, like just completing the bonus world? Yeah. So there's like 10. Oh, right. 10 achievements for. Uh, oh, no. For uh, the normal game and then one extra for the bonus one. How do these work again? Why aren't they switching? Wasn't that how they worked? I thought that's how they worked. Oh, only when you bounce? Did we learn that? Was that a tutorial? I didn't even notice that. I thought it was like any time you dashed at all. Whoa. Whoa, Jesus, okay. It's getting like thundery. Oh, whoops. Oh, right. Okay, that, that's a little annoying. That might be one of the effects that you can, like, turn down with the, the flashing setting. Oh, no. Yeah, I gotta, like, make use of the checkpointing a little more. Yeah, so it did change. Like, it was just dashing before, and now it's when you bounce. Yeah, we should save like here. Yeah, not a fan of that like simulated thunder thing. So what is this thing? Nothing? There we go. It's one of these. Uh, gotta like try and go through here, but now we have to bounce again. Uh oh! Oh crap! Yeah, I'm dead. There we go. That's what I wanted. Can you save in these? Nope. And then here, we still have to like bounce on this thing to make these whole. Yeah, this is a completely new mechanic. All right, finally we can checkpoint. Wait, where am I going? Am I going up? Kind of? There might be something down here. It's bonus then. No, this seems like the way to go. Oh, holy shit. Yeah, we got like timed... 
timed platforms, so to speak. Okay, so this must be a secret then, I hope. Hmm. Hold on. There we go. No! No, no! God damn it. <laughs> oh man, I have to redo that. Yeah, these are pretty tricky. Uh oh. Oh no. Crap. Yeah, you do have to be very, very precise. Wait, what? Okay, still got it. Right, I had to like bounce on that again, really, but that's fine. Is anything going on here on the left? Not much. Okay. Oh, that was bad. It was already the way it was supposed to be. Yeah, maybe, uh, maybe we should turn this off, like maybe not minimal, but reduced. Let's see what that does. Nothing. Yeah, that, that doesn't do anything. I don't know. It's a little, little annoying for me. Minimal. Nope, th this just doesn't count as flashing, I guess. Even though I find it kind of annoying. Yeah, strange. Alright, well, I'll have it on normal then. Maybe you have to, like, exit the level before that actually works. I don't know. Nice. There's another one up there. Oh, crap. That's fine. And it's very forgiving, at least. I like that everything is saved. Wait, wasn't there something up here? I thought I saw a collectible up there. God, please. Aha. Uh -huh. There we go. Oh, no. Whoa. Jesus. That's kind of crazy. So I can, like, dash into these, yeah. I guess that's what you're meant to do. But then we, like, dash out here, bounce here, and then I have to like, get in somehow. Or I can try and dash from here. Nope. Get some height. That works. Okay. 
Yeah, very tricky all of a sudden. And that was like three or four of those. I don't remember. Anything else around here? Don't think so. Seems like something's gonna be up here, yeah? Oh boy. Uh, I have to, like, wait here. Not quite. Nice. There we go. God, I hate this flashing! <laughs> That's so annoying! Oh, that was death. Well, that's fine. We got the thing. Hello? Do I save you or something? Nope. Yeah, the music is very, very, uh, Ernog. Like, you can tell it's the same procedural music program. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Nothing up here. Is that a black hole? Nope, nothing. Careful. Hmm. How do we deal with this? Oh, I see. We have to do this kind of thing. No! And yeah, I didn't even realize. I think all of these things we're, like, gathering are all the, the friends we had. Like, watching TV at the... in the intro. Everyone was scattered, and I guess we're, like, going around... Like, collecting people. Saving everyone. A very deep story. And that seems to be it. I hope I got everything. Yep, got everything. So new now we get another tutorial. Refn. Whatever that means. Uh. Doesn't really seem like this is gonna teach anything in particular. Just that you can't, like, sit here. You have to make sure you don't go in these things, I guess. So you kind of have to avoid them. Uh-oh. It's a little too much. Let's just go, like, straight up. Yeah, not too bad. That, like, normal platforms can also be obstacles in a way, I guess. Very pretty effects on the right. Up here. I love that ping mechanic. That's such a nice addition. So you don't have to just, like, 
run around aimlessly. Nörrebro Parken. It's uh, something like I don't know North Bridge Park, maybe. And five of those again. More trains. Interesting sounds here. Ah, right. What's these things again? These are interesting. Oh dear. No. No. <laughs> God damn it. It's so weird when it's like diagonal like this. There we go. Nice. Hello. What's up? Uh-oh. I can save this. Oh, I can't. Nope. Oh, man. That's kind of a trap. That is a trap. Maybe we want to actually, like, go up here instead? This is, like, safer. Yeah, that just is much easier than trying to go through the tunnel. Oh, damn. Should be fine here. Yeah. Ah, eh, that doesn't matter. Yeah, I like the, uh, the readability of levels. Like, even when it's tricky, it's always very clear what it is you're meant to do. Or most of the time, anyway. Like, all of the color-coded mechanics and stuff are very, uh, well thought out. Uh, I feel like I was supposed to have this be the other way. Or maybe we have to go and switch it and then come back or something? This is interesting, like, climbing. Yeah, I feel like I'm missing something. Oh, crap. Could I... can I switch from here? Yeah, like, switch here? Uh-oh. And then go in here. I feel like that's what you're meant to do to get a secret up here. Yeah. yeah I'm, I'm curious about turning on the assist options as well for like extra air control and stuff. Because I really feel like you have enough air control. It doesn't feel bad at all. But I guess some people would struggle with it, so more assist options are always good. 
Uh oh, I'm struggling with it. Alright, time to climb again. Uh oh. Okay. Gotta get that reset. Ah, uh, let's play it safe and do one more. Oh my god, safe I say. God damn it. So much for air control. I don't know if there's any better way to climb this. You don't really get much height when you bounce. I think it's probably just this way. Yeah, okay. Much better. So, probably a secret up here, I would imagine. Aw, oh, crap. That's actually fine. Surely this is a secret, and not where we're going, right? Yep. Probably try and be on, like, the upside, the top side of that. That's also good. We can also make use of these more. Just to launch. Like that. Uh. God damn it. Alright, let's go back. That wasn't very good. Crap. Hold on. No! Oh, god damn it. This is a hard section. Oh no. No! Yeah, I need to get that angle on that one. I'm, I'm trying to go for this one, but it doesn't really work. There we go. Yeah, that was hard. So, do we have... Anything extra? Nope. Again, such good readability. Muck bean. Bini? What? Uh oh. No! God damn it. All of that gone. <sighs> Jesus. It's also a really nice touch. There's like input buffering when you're in these things. If you hold down A, like by the time you go out, like here, I can just hold it. And then as soon as I leave, I'm just in like dash mode. So you can just like take the time you need.
Mm, let's just do this. So I reset my dash. Here we go. Oh god, is it like extremely loud, the music? <laughs> I haven't really been paying attention, but... Now it's more normal, but yeah, right there, it seemed like it was very loud. But I guess that's kind of the experience. I think I forgot to check if, like, last time was well balanced as well. I usually try and, like, confirm that. I don't feel like I'm done. I never feel like I got all five. I always feel like I only get like three or four. And yet somehow it seems like I have gotten everything. Yeah. I don't know. So, tutorial again? A Malian body? I don't know. Body means uh, like castle or burg, keep, that kind of thing. Not sure about the first part. No, 100%. Skip ending. Oh, I see. It's the cutscene. Well, there you go. A singlet. Yeah, definitely a, a very short experience. Even on challenging mode, that was like less than two hours. Time to refund it, I guess. <laughs> but yeah, I did, do really uh, enjoy it. I like the atmosphere and procedural music and stuff. And just the controls feel extremely good. And again, all the like fun mechanics and very tricky mechanics and just good readability and stuff. Everyone gather up for the new broadcast of whatever. I swear I saw Spider-Man in the intro. Or at least someone dressed as Spider-Man. Got all of them. Almost a little, like, manifold garden of an ending. <laughs> Time to watch, like, a, a Windows Media Player visualizer. Yep, that, that's actually what we're doing. <laughs> I don't know if I'm getting this because I had 100% or if this is just the ending. Yeah, just overall, this, this entire game has a very, like, kaleidoscopic feel to it. The visuals, it's very interesting. New difficulty unlocked. Too difficult. Oh. Well, we are not done then. I see. Yeah, I guess I gotta do that first. The super hard mode before I go back to easier ones. Yeah, I like how Sada Sanbari has been like working with Niflis for pretty much as long as he's been making games. I don't know what kind of relationship they have, if they're friends or or more, but just like, she's been consistently making art for everything since, I think, Knit? Or something like that? Maybe even within a deep forest? I don't know. But pretty much every Niflis game has art by, by Sada Sanbari. And yeah, it's very uh, charming. A very distinct style. 
almost a little bit like Swedish Finnish like fairy tale thing like Tuve Jansson the Moomin series he's got kind of that vibe going Weirdly ominous credit sequence. Yeah, there we go. I mean, again, it is a very short experience, so, like, is it worth it? Is it worth your money? I mean, I guess that's for you to decide, but I think this is very uh, neat and charming, even though it's maybe a little short. Let's see how we have. Too difficult, but I guess before I do that, I'm more curious about the bonus world. So let's jump into that. You can have three, uh, three uh, files on the bonus world as well. I see. Yeah. So like, if you just toggle, then you just tap the key and then tap again to dash. I like the hold one. Yeah, let's try a bonus on just challenging as well. So is it like just one level or is it an entire world? Struts. Or is it struts as an ostrich? That's the word. Difficulty does change the game in meaningful ways, in your opinion? Yeah, I, I can kind of see that, because, I mean, just changing the difficulty would change, like, the entire layout of the levels, I guess. So, we might play it through on pretty much all of them. Oh god, what do I do? Oh, right, this. Interesting little sequence. Doesn't seem like there are any uh, collectibles here. I guess we just, like, go through. Just wanted to check. Wait, what? How do we get enough speed here? Oh! This is kind of a, a new thing, I guess, because you preserve momentum with this thing. Yeah. Neat. Yeah, like, I, I kind of noticed that, but never really, like, thought about it in the normal game, because it wasn't really needed. Yeah, cool. This is a nice step up so far. Oh, yep, that's one of those. Uh, hold on, so I need to do this. And then now... Oh boy, what do I do now? I guess I, like... Do this kind of thing, and then dash over here again, yeah. And now what? Oh boy, yeah, kind of just a challenge level. So is that it? Was that the bonus world or are there more levels? There are more levels, okay. So it is like an entire bonus campaign, Ekkore, which means a uh, uh, squirrel. <laughs> now it's just like Swedish things, but maybe the, that's the same in Danish. Uh-oh. Saved. Oh, God. Oh, no. 
Okay. No problem. That's that. What? Snobla? <laughs> it's at? Like, an email address at sign? I've never seen anyone write it with a dash, though. I guess you do? Yeah. Never thought about that. Need to wait here a little bit. Oh, this is a problem. Yeah, this is a problem. Okay. Not quite. There we go. I'm just gonna keep climbing. Yeah, seems like you can. Wait, but now what? I guess you weren't supposed to do that? Uh oh. It's a bit of a problem. Oh, crap. Oh, boy. I keep getting the a bad angle. But I guess this works. Just skip one at a time. Nice. I don't know what was up with the, the red thing at the top there. That didn't seem to do anything. I guess you could maybe like jump from there all the way to the end. Might have been like a speedrun strat. Fyr kant. Square. You're all getting, getting just like a Swedish lesson now. <laughs> just a bunch of random words translated. Uh, so what do we do here? Probably not that. Yeah, I guess just bounce and then fly through. Let's just do that. Oh, crap, too much. Yeah, maybe just like shoot through, bounce. Go all the way. Almost bad. All right, nice. Let me just check quick. We're missing two achievements. 101% 101.pdf. Okay. Are we doing some like ARG stuff? And then tack, play through the bonus world. All right, let's worry about this first. I guess there's some some kind of file we need to dig up here. 
Yeah, it's right here. Fika! <laughs> Which means like, how, oh god, how do you even translate that? It's like... It's like what the Brits would call tea. Just the, the meal tea. It's like in Sweden, just having like a little sandwich and some some coffee and a cinnamon bun or something. That That's fika. <laughs> what is that thing? A jellyfish? An octopus? Yeah, who knows? Some kind of weird squid amoeba single cell or very few cell organism. Might be main game plus extras completed. I don't think so. I imagine since since it does say like 101.pdf, I imagine there's a file that we can find in, in the uh, game files. I can see Niflis doing something like that. Wow, this is suddenly like very bright, isn't it? This level is like way brighter than the white levels before. <laughs> it's kind of strange. Oh, this is kind of tricky. How do we... Hold on. Yeah, I needed a little less speed. Ah, crap. That's gone, right? Yeah, they're gone. Uh, wait. Yeah, okay. Crap. Oh, this is this is a mean one. Don't count on getting that achievement. Uh-oh. How the hell do we do this? What? Ah, oh, man. How do we, like, get up after that? I need to then afterwards get up for, for this one and probably end with the top left. But that's really hard. Can you go, like, all the way from here? No, like, across to there, maybe? If I do, like... Maybe even a... Shallower angle, like that, and then bounce on the left side. You can do that. So that's a way to get up here. Oh shit, <laughs> hello Niflis. A wild Dr. Unskan appears, yeah. These are some, uh, some evil levels. Specifically this one. Ah, oh, crap. Okay, that's a good start. Oh boy, no, wait, I can save it. I need to like get a shallower angle. This is not gonna work. Oh boy. No, I think I'm doomed. Oh, I could have like landed there again, right? Should go for the, the blue. Okay, that's better. That's what I want. Oh, no! Oh, fuck you! <laughs> God damn it. Okay. Yep, that's what I need to do. Yeah, that was close. One more like that. Oh, that's bad. Hold on. Reset. Gotta get that right angle. There we go. Nice. That's actually really fun. Like, that is definitely the hardest level so far, but in a very fun way.
down here next. Bråket, which means like the what would you even translate that as? Like the the argument, the the fight. What's what's up with this one now? Do we want to like intentionally pop all these bubbles? Yeah, I, I guess so. Pop all of them and then quickly go and collect all these before they're back. Something like that, yeah. Skip this one for now. Oh, damn it. Okay, messed that up. Do these just not come back? Do they only come back when you, like, touch a, a real tile or something? There we go. Yeah, this one wasn't too bad. Yeah, they're like more puzzly, these levels, the bonus levels. Sad screevening. Oh boy. That is like not even possible to explain. Jesus, yeah. Can't really explain that. It's like... Writing words that we Swedes write as... We write multiple words as one word. And it's a very common mistake. It's a common mistake to write them as multiple words. Because they are multiple words, but we write them as one word. It, it's nonsense. <laughs> and the joke there is that those aren't two words. That should have been one word. Oh, crap, right? I don't want to dash. Actually, I should have dashed, but hold on, let's check left. Wait, what? Oh! Oh, right! These aren't the dash ones, these are the, the bounce ones, I see! Okay, clever. So we can't just, like, dash to get the blue ones to to be active. We have to, like, go all the way left, bounce, and then make sure I don't use up all of those platforms to get back. Yeah, ba basically that, Sirgo. <laughs> yeah, so to switch this, we have to go over here, so let's... Like, try and use every other one or something? Oh, that was a terrible dash. Oh, this is bad. I'm not gonna get enough distance. Crap. There we go. I think this is better. We get a save point. Nice. Jesus. <laughs> Guess I should save down here instead. Mm, not good. Actually, no, not good. Actually, maybe. works.
No! Oh, I had it. Damn. Little bit quicker on that. Thank God for the slowdown when you dash. If that didn't exist, this would be hopeless. Oh, internet's wobbly? Am I dropping frames? Or is it your internet? Uh, doesn't say I'm dropping any frames on my end. Oh, Jesus. I almost failed that. Yeah, those red barrier mazes are very difficult because, like, you need to be so quick on them and have very precise dashes to, like, bounce the exact way. Katten, the cat. Probably your internet. I guess let me know if there are any issues. If there's multiple people. I see. Are we gonna do this one? Not like that. Oh boy. This seems tough. So you just go down? Nice. Oh crap! Oh, come on! Well, at least it saved. And these just keep going. I wasn't expecting the bonus world to have this much. Fence. It's like no good. Or uh what would you say? Like yeah, they're up to no good. You've also been getting some stream stalls? Hmm. Yeah, I don't know if that's on my end or or Twitch in that case. What? What are these? Are these like the green ones? No? What? Oh, are they like... no? I was thinking they were like dash refills. Are they? But only if you dash through them. So if I like dash into one, it doesn't refill my dash. But if I dash through one, we do get the dash back. Interesting. New mechanics. This far into the game. Uh, it's a bit of a, an issue. Up or down? Probably up. Right, so now I have to, like, hold on. We have to dash through it here and then back. Yeah. Or just do it twice, I guess. Like that. To wait here a little bit. Actually, I can just dash up. 
yeah, so far, nothing too bad for, like, the last couple of levels. Those, like, one-screen levels are almost the hardest ones, where you just have, like, one screen of a really hard thing you have to do. Vuven, like, the puppy, or the pupper. Ugh. <laughs> yeah, these ones. These are generally, like, the harder ones, but this doesn't look too bad. Since we just get, like, free refills all the time. Except now. Never mind. Oh god. Yeah, not too bad. Ooh, at it. Like uneaten? Or not having eaten? I don't know. Or just like un un not not uneaten, but like what would you even say? The act of reverse eating. <laughs> I don't know. Wait, where are we going here? Just up? Oh! But I have to bounce. Ah, over there, I see. It's no Lenska for being hungry, I see. I didn't even know that. <laughs> yeah, there's, there's quite a few words here that are like a little unfamiliar to me and like Danish adjacent and stuff like that. So we go this way, do a bounce, uh, probably a bounce above would be better. Actually, that should work. Yeah, now they're active. Oh, I fucked up. Damn it. So that's why that red bar is there, just to, so you can reset it. I guess you're meant to dash into this one, like that. Is this a special cube? No? Just background? Oh shit, what am I doing? Wait, oh god, where are we going? So I'm assuming these are all like traps. We have to actually avoid the trains this time. Uh, I have to bounce somewhere though. Probably this one. Yeah. And how do I get up there? If we just go from here, I guess, like that way. There we go. That was a fun one. Very, like, neat use of the mechanics. Namless. Nameless. That one's pretty, uh, self-explanatory. Another, another one of these, huh? I see, so dashing through these also flips these uh, tiles. 
So we want to have this active to begin with. Unless I want to start on the right. But do this. Ah, oh, crap. Didn't get the refill. Uh, yeah, I think you go from the left. I think I see how to do this. Wait, hold on. Do that again. And then more to the right. Ah, yeah. Like that. Just better. Damn. I don't think I have to bounce on that. Crap. Oh, that's not good. No, that didn't count. Oh, and I just realized these are just like normal ones. You don't actually have to go through the green specifically to flip these. And it just keeps going on. <laughs> keeps on going. Crocodile. Crocodile. Many of these words you probably can just guess. Whoa. Supernova? This looks like a like Dyson Sphere or something. Oh no. The flashing lightning effect is back. Not a huge fan of that. I guess we just kind of like go around the entire place here. Oh, that's a neat touch too, I didn't notice. You like, your little aiming thing gets updated when, like it becomes green when you know you'll get the dash back. I didn't notice that before. So we have to go all the way around, huh? I don't know where the best place to start is. I guess it doesn't really matter. Go right. There we go. Oh boy. Uh, no, ah, I fucked up. Damn it. it was close. I'm wondering if it's better to like try and go for the ones at the bottom here first because I imagine that's kind of harder but now we're going the opposite way around you can disable flashing lights in the settings I that one didn't seem to affect it or at least when I try, do you have to like restart the level for that? I tried both minimal and reduced and like the flashing still seems to happen. The like blue flashing specifically. And it's really only that, nothing else.
Oh, I guess it's disabled now. Oops. Let's just try uh, reduce then. Okay, let's try going from this way around instead, because there's like a big gap here. So let's try and end with a right one, I feel is probably uh, better. I guess it's a little less, like, harsh to look at with reduced. Ah, oh, damn it. Wait, it's fine. You need to head off? Alright, thanks for stopping by. It's nice to see you. I never imagined you would show up to one of my streams. Yeah, hopefully, uh, you have something else cooking. <laughs> I'm looking forward to more stuff. Oh boy, this is the problem. Yeah, that's the problem. Hmm. I mean, I could've just gone for it. I didn't even need to reset. I could've just gone for the final thing. Or hell, maybe we start with this one instead. Since this, this part is giving me trouble, let's just, like, go here. That could be better. What? Didn't get my recharge. Let's save over here. Yeah, I think this is a better order. Uh oh. Let's try and save this. Ooh. Hold on, I have to wait here. There we go. Nice. Yeah, that was an interesting one as well. I wonder how these are named. What about that level was a crocodile? <laughs> Grat Uh It's like a soup spoon, but specifically for porridge. Usually just like... A wooden spoon. Good. Good start. This one seems a little more flexible, like you can probably do it in a few different ways. I'm just going to wait here. There we go. Yeah, that was not bad. I just keep expecting it to just end. Seal. Uh, herring. What? Oh, you get, like, free flight for a second. I see. Yeah, it's... It's crazy that it's just more mechanics over and over. It just keeps going. I see. So we have to, like, dodge these. Crap.
This reminds me of uh, Niflis's other like mini games. It's like the Seven series with seven light years, seven nano cycles, seven something. I, I can't remember what they're all called, but there was a very similar mechanic to this, I think, in one of them. They're like free games on his website. They're pretty interesting. Seven Meditations was one of them. All right, not bad. Ah, oh, damn it. Didn't wait long enough. We don't even need the free flight. Oh boy. Oh god. Gotta wait a bit. Come on. Ah, man. Well, we are done, even if I fail. There we go. Yeah, more new mechanics all the time. Oh? Oh. I thought it was like fading out as in like, you're done. Final level. Triangle. Can you guess what that word is? Hmm. Not so sure. The E and L are just in the wrong place. Can't decipher it. Okay, just free flight around. Uh. <laughs> I like how the music is just like really disappointed. Oh, damn it. If I committed to left, I would have been able to do it. There we go. Oh, and stolen, which is not stolen, but it's the chair. <laughs> oh, there's another one of those like really bright levels. Whiter than white. This one's just all about bouncing, I guess. Not too bad. That's it. Wait, is it? Oh no. I guess we have to like, find a dude. And then the exit will uh, be activated.
Or just power all these. Hmm. Let's try and get a bigger bounce. I kind of wish there were more, like, momentum things with these blue platforms. There was, like, one level that made use of that. It's kind of an interesting mechanic that, like, you can bounce on them from very high up in order to get a much higher bounce. This is the last one, so I'm just going to go for it. Yeah. And perfect. <laughs> Are we even going to be able to finish this today? I don't know. This keeps adding. Pankakan. You should be able to decipher that as well. The pancake. Uh-huh. Not good. Not good. Don't want to touch that. And now we can just go for it. Nice. <laughs> this is going full suicide mode is the easiest. Coppen, the cup. And these are the dashing ones, yeah? Wait, oh! But they're new ones, they're like timed. I see. Yeah, and I fucked up. Yeah, it's really well implemented, like, letting you experience what the new mechanic is in a way where you can't, like, mistake it for anything or whatever. Like, it's perfectly... Perfectly spaced so that you will realize how these work. Uh, I feel like I was supposed to dash there, like right away. Suddenly, like, siren. Yeah, so we do this and then they'll be back in time, yeah. The art style also kind of reminds me a little bit of Patapon, in a way. And there was another game, like, on PSP, I think, that had a similar art style. That wasn't, like... Uh... Oh man, what was that called again? Hmm. I can't remember. Wait, how do we do this one? Oh, just go down? I guess we just build up momentum here? Wait, what? I get up there.
Hmm. I have no idea how I can get enough momentum to get to the right one, or like stall long enough to get to the right one. Not, not like that. Oh. Yeah, am, am I dropping? Twitch is definitely doing something weird. It's connecting to chat now. Hmm. I'm not even sure I'm, I'm live. Just a couple days ago, Twitch was having this, like, Thursday, I think? Yeah, welcome to the chat room! Twitch was having, like, severe issues a couple days ago. And, uh... Yeah, like, when I... It was Wednesday, I think? When I was streaming, uh, Hades? Or was that Thursday? There might be some issues now as well, hold on. Hopefully the VOD is fine, though. I'm just gonna check. Uh, not really. I don't know. Yeah, that's, that's annoying. Not really anything I can do about that. Just have to hope that it gets fixed. Hmm. How the hell do we do this? We can't dash again. Yeah, this this one I just don't understand like what I'm supposed to do. much less, like, actually doing it. Like, it seems like we have to build up a bunch of momentum and bounce on the bottom one, but I don't see how to do that. Wish you could cancel the dash once you've, like, engaged it. We can do that, but now what? I can't jump this. I can't jump that. But then, was that just a red herring? I feel like that was not what you were meant to do. I don't know. And once again, I think we want to, like, build up momentum here. Yeah, like that kind of thing. Almost feels like I'm missing something about, like, how to build up more momentum. There we go. Hmm? Now what? What? I- something is not clicking here. I feel like there's some mechanic I'm not, like, aware of. Oh wait, no, I just bounce. Uh, just dash up and then bounce. Yeah, okay, never mind. Just a bit of a tricky puzzle. Yeah, there was that one part I'm not entirely sure what you were meant to actually do, but it worked out. Bulen. The bun. Hold on one second. There we go. Just tried to load up my own stream to see if it would load, and yeah, it is loading, so... Uh, when Twitch was having issues the other day, streams were still fine. You could still watch streams, but you couldn't connect to any any chats. 
So maybe something like that is going on now again, which is fun. Seems like the bottom one is going to be hard here. No, it's not. We can just do that. Yeah, never mind. That's not bad. Even saved it. Krukin. Okay, that, I don't even know. The cheese bend? The cheese hook? No clue what that means. Probably some kind of slang, again. You see, we have the timed ones again. This one seems a lot more flexible so far. Hmm. Now what, though? Oh god, wait. Was I not supposed to get in here? Oh no, I am. Okay. I thought I messed up. Yeah, this feels more like a normal level in the, like, normal world. Well, this is a bit trippy to look at. Ah, right, bubbles. Where are we going? How do these work again? Like... Right, when I touch a, a normal tile, their pole... Ah, so I probably have to, like, not dash at all here. If I can. Maybe I have to dash once, but then, like, maintain my dashes and just fly around. Yeah, to get up here. I see. And then don't dash. Keep just not dashing. Until now? We not want to dash here? Okay, that's fine. Oh! Yep, okay. We can't even save here. That was kind of mean. There we go. Give me this save point.
Yeah, this one is interesting. Just like sequential kind of puzzle segments. Just slowly iterating on the same kind of mechanic. Very long level too. Very long train rides as well. Oh, all of that just to get here. I wonder, there's probably some way you can like cheese this. I wonder how. Surely you can like land there. Cotton, the pine cone kind of thing. Yeah, I'm, I'm not even sure I'm gonna have time to do all of these today. Oh boy, wait. How do we do this? Oh, I have to like specifically bounce in the ceiling? Guess I don't have to do it anymore, but yeah, okay. That's an interesting take on it. Heart. Tack. Thank you. This must be the last one. it's pink. Maybe it's not even gonna be like, oh, yep, heart. It might not even be like a full level, just a bit of a cinematic thing. Bunch of hearts. Audio is like muted as well, all of the sound effects. Is this the final train ride? So many hearts, nothing but hearts. Yeah, there we go. Tack. Tack själv. Ah. Uh. Oh, there's a final thing. Salute it. The end. Negative mode unlocked. Enable it in the new file menu. Negative mode? And now we get the credits again. <laughs> I guess I'll skip the credits again. We just saw them. Okay. So... If we do, like, story world... Negative mode... What the hell? Let's just try, like, negative mode... Normal challenging mode, just to see what that is. I guess it's just visual? Like, it's just negative. Just the same levels, but the entire game is, like, inverted. Yeah, I guess so. Negative normal is good to try next. Really? Negative normal instead of, like, negative too difficult? I'm thinking that might be what I want to do. Because does negative change anything about the actual game? It's not just visual? Oh. Okay. But by normal you mean challenging, right? Because challenging is like default normal, I guess, default difficulty. Even though there's tricky and chill, I guess tricky might be considered normal. Whatever you did your first playthrough on. Yeah, okay. Well, I mean... I think that's, in that case, a good place to uh, 
end it off for today. So yeah, okay. We'll be back with Inglets again. We'll do a challenging negative mode. And then I guess challenging negative mode in the bonus world. And then I have to try like too difficult normal and maybe too difficult negative. I don't know. We'll have to see what all of the different challenges or difficulties are all about. And how much I'll want to play this. But yeah, very nice little game. And there's more to it than I kind of expected. So I'll take a, a break and then we're going to swap over to some Hades because why wouldn't we? I can't not play Hades. <laughs>